The world's population is growing, and for many, living standards will continue to improve. As a result, global energy demand is expected to double by 2050. To help meet this demand, gas will form an increasingly important role. Natural gas is plentiful, and it's the cleanest burning fossil fuel. But some natural gas resources are in remote locations. Transporting the gas long distances by pipeline can be costly and impractical. The solution? We liquefy the gas by cooling it, which shrinks its volume for easier, economical, and safe transportation by ship. So how is liquefied natural gas produced? Natural gas extracted from the ground contains impurities, water, and other associated liquids. First, it is processed to clean it. It goes through a series of pipes and vessels where gravity helps separate the gas from some of the heavier liquids. Other impurities are then stripped out. The natural gas passes through a water-based solvent that absorbs carbon dioxide and hydrogen sulfide. These would otherwise freeze when the gas is cooled and so cause blockages. Next, any remaining water is removed, as this would also freeze. Finally, remaining lighter natural gas liquids, mainly propane and butane, are extracted to be sold separately or used as a refrigerant later in the cooling process. Traces of mercury are also filtered out. Now the purified natural gas, methane with some ethane, is ready to be liquefied. This happens in heat exchangers. A coolant, chilled by giant refrigerators, absorbs the heat from the natural gas. It cools the gas to minus 162 degrees centigrade, shrinking its volume by 600 times. This turns it into a clear, colorless, non-toxic liquid, liquefied natural gas, or LNG, that is much easier to store and transport. The LNG is kept in insulated tanks until it is ready for loading into a specially designed LNG ship or carrier. Some of the LNG is shipped overseas and regasified to power homes and businesses. LNG for transport is offloaded into separate storage tanks and a midway facility known as a brake bulk terminal. Small carriers supply barges, ferries, cruise liners, container ships, and tankers in ports, on rivers, and in coastal areas. Shell has also helped develop technology to liquefy natural gas on a small scale. This approach uses movable modular liquefaction plants, built in sections to be scaled up or down and potentially moved to another location. The plants can supply transport customers directly, making LNG more accessible. Railroads and tanker trucks carry the LNG to storage tanks at refueling stations for large trucks. Double-walled, vacuum-insulated tanks keep the LNG cool. The pumps and gauges look different, but pumping LNG is like pumping conventional diesel. Compared to conventional diesel, as a transport fuel, LNG has the potential to offer significant fuel cost savings, as well as economic and environmental benefits for operators of large truck fleets and marine vessels. In future, LNG usage may expand into other areas, including rail and mining. Shell believes LNG can help meet the growing energy demand by making more use of natural gas, the cleanest burning fossil fuel.